Dude, that is so catchy. It's like reggae. What are those? What are those? Oh no! There they are again. Dude, what are those shoes? Those shoes are incredible. Dude, I wear shoes like that too. That's why I'm like astounded because I get made fun of all the time. Dude, that girl is very cute too. Look at those childbearing hips and those nice long legs and those nice khaki slacks. <laughs> Just as catchy. That's a how he's going to do it. sound of the keyboards in Inirindu with with the bend when he's bending the strings so okay on a keyboard they have that little a ball that or not ball it's like a half ball it's like a thing that you roll so you hit a note on the keyboard and you roll that thing and it makes that ding. he's doing that on the guitar you know what I'm talking about I hope I explained that right dude he's making it just as catchy you gotta be kidding me I get really happy when I find new music that I actually really like, that really flows through me. I'm telling you, this song is incredible. Dang, I'm gonna be jamming it all day. You don't need to be looking at your, your fingers, mate. It's all good. <laughs> Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> dude. This is the catchiest song I've ever heard. Be a little saucy there. Not to mention what Ellipse playing is pretty difficult. I'm not gonna lie. It may not be the hardest thing he's ever played, but what he's playing is quite difficult. He's using a lot uh, of his pinky. So, and you always know, if you watch my other uh, videos, that when, when a guitarist uses his pinky effortlessly, that's a sign that he's a pro. Dude, by the way, on a separate note, what's homeboy wearing? What's, uh, Harja, what's he wearing? Is that like a Indonesian traditional like outfit or something? Cause that outfit is awesome. And those shoes dough. <laughs> those shoes dough. It's definitely got a tropical flavor. Picture yourself on the beach definitely. Sipping a little cocktail. What 
this song, guys. I should want to dance. Damn. <laughs> If you're not like me right now, is there anybody that could be like this? <laughs> I love that little bend there. Gotta take the pause for the cause, but I will back it up so we will go back into that nice and easy transition once again. Outstanding, my man here, Alapata. Always precise, always right on point with his maneuvering of his fingers and the sounds. I'm watching, I'm spending some time watching his right hand and his thumb hitting that thumb drum beat, to keep that beat going. You know, loving it. He's hitting it hard for a bass sound and strumming it, and it's beautiful. I don't, I love exams focusing on different parts each time and try to apply it when I pick up my guitar. And I'm incredible, man. This guy is just like, he's teaching so many people new styles, new techniques, new, new innovative thoughts on what you can do with this instrument. Let's roll. Dude, that lip's doing a great job too, though. Catchy, bro. He's got that rhythm. Doesn't miss. I dare anyone out there having a bad day to listen to this track and not get a little bit uplifted. Did you see what he just did right there? He had his, this finger on the, the top E and then he did a hammer on pull off with his pinky on the, on the high E. I'm sorry, he had, he had this finger on the low E and he did a hammer on pull off with this on the high E. You know how hard that is to do? You gotta have some serious ability to stretch these two fingers and control and strengthen that pinky finger. Right here, look, I'll go back, right here. Right here, right here. That. That's hard to do, I'm telling you. I've been playing guitar for 20 years. <laughs> I would know. <laughs> you know what I love? The user suggesting these tracks by a leap and then a leap's uh, helping me to discover all these other artists I've never heard of too. Always win, win, win. Nah, it'd be awesome to just to sit and chill. I don't smoke with them. I don't smoke, but I smoke, but not cigarettes. So 